Hello everyone, I'm Izumi Annalisa, and today we're making internet crush characters in The Sims. You guys know I love my internet crush characters, okay? If you don't know what internet crush is, I don't know why you're watching this video, but it's a MCTV series that I made, and I am obsessed with these characters, and I love them, and they're my babies. So, why not make them in The Sims today? Why not? Ignore that my buttons are broken. You didn't see a thing. <laughs> Ignore it. I don't know what mod did that. If you know what mod... Might have done that. I'd appreciate your input in the comments down below, but if you don't know, just pretend you don't see it. First and foremost, let's start with our girl, Izumi Isaka. Okay, so she's a teen, so we're gonna make her a teen. She's also of the female variety. We're not gonna mess with walks. I never do walks. Does anyone ever do walks? We're also not gonna mess with voice. I never mess with voice. Does anyone? Does anyone? I don't know. I have no clue. She, her pronouns. She wants love in her life. I honestly would give her the soulmate aspiration. She's pretty like, she loves the lovey-dovey. She's creative. Mmm. Uh, mmm. Clumsy. She's a clumsy girl. She's a music lover. She loves music. Um, And she's also a nerd. Geek. There we go. Yes. Okay. Let's go ahead and strip her down and see what we're working with here. We got we got bigger titties than that. And a bigger booty than that. And bigger thighs than that. I'd probably say that's about accurate to her body type. Maybe a little bit. Yeah, that's about accurate. That's about accurate. And then let's go ahead and replace her her brows. Because she got some, <laughs> those brows. They're <laughs> prominent. <laughs> a little too prominent. Um... I actually don't know if I have a pink hair that actually matches Izumi's hair color. We might have to go CC shopping, guys, to find some pink hair that matches. Um, I'd say that one's probably the closest. And then for lips, I hate how those look. They look so cute here. I think you need a skin, the Twisted Cat skin, to make it look decent at all okay and then for eyes i i love these specific eyes these specific eyes they're like my go-to i kind of want to go for them but i kind of want to switch it up because i always do them those are cute but that these are probably more accurate these are definitely more accurate we'll go with these okay now for face shape she has this, like, a pretty round baby face, but it's not as pointy, if that makes sense. Because this is a pretty pointy face. And then, I don't know why she got br bright red brows going on here. Let's give her just, like, brown to start to see if that works. She's got purple eyes, which I think these are probably the closest to the purple that they are in the show. Yeah, I'd probably say these are the closest that they are in the show. Now for my favorite part. Genuinely one of my favorite parts of making Sims. I'm a CC girl. I love me some CC. Um, I'm a Maxis Match girly. I am... Oh, the eyelashes. Yes! Eyelashes and the final skin. Just... Ugh. And I do have the Twisted Cat skin. I don't use it very frequently. Normally it's the glass skin. The glass, the Twisted Cat glass skin, not the lemonade one, which is Twisted Cat still. So maybe it would go with the lips. I don't know. Um, oh, she's so cute. Look at her. I think she has freckles in my head. Like that. Ooh, you can give her body freckles? Oh, that's cute. Okay. We'll do like that. Just like a little bridge of the nose freckles. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh, she's so pretty. Let's make her boobs not defy gravity, maybe. Might be nice. Don't demonetize me, please. Okay, for hair, let's see. I don't know if I have a pink hair that actually fits. Because, like, the Mac the Maxis pink hair, that's not, that's, that is not it. That's not it, you know? Do I have any custom hair reshades? Hmm, I thought I did. Let's scavenger hunt. That's the closest I've found. 
but it's too short. Oh, I'm sneezing. I'm allergic to hotness. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Do I? Ooh. I thought this one was close, but it's not. Eh, it's not that far off. Oh, skin tone. She's paler than this. Hold on. Also, her... Where'd her monolid go? Oh, is that because of this, this skin? Like, she doesn't look Asian <laughs> after the skin's put on. Where did her Asian go? Oh, there we go. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Okay. Okay, girly, I see you. Okay, all of these, all of these have a pink. Oh, that's pretty. Also, guys, did you guys know there's limited time uh, Internet Crush Christmas merch down in the description below? You should go check it out if you haven't seen it yet. It's super cute. I actually have one of the hoodies literally on the bed behind me because I was wearing it last night when I was sleeping. I have the Mako hoodie behind me. Ah, look at her. We have hoodies of all the main cast, as well as a collaborative hoodie with everyone on it, as well as Izumi and Kenji under the mistletoe. So go check those out. Anyways, back to the video. Sorry for the little promo break there, but you know, girls gotta do what a girls gotta do. Make sure you guys see the merch because it's so cute and limited time. Did I mention it was going to be gone forever? This is really cute. I honestly really like the little bang moment. This is so Izumi. But is it too like anime girl? What am I kidding? Is it too anime girl? Shut up Izumi. Izumi? Not you. Me. Sorry. It gets confusing sometimes. Oh my god that's so cute. Oh my god. <gasps> Girly pop. Oh right skin tone. Forgot to change your skin tone. That's I think more accurate. Oh my god. She's so pretty. She looks more Asian than Asian, I will say. And I feel like she should look more Asian because she is Asian. <laughs> what? How? But here's the thing. If she had darker eyes, she'd look so much more Asian. But that's just, she's an anime character. So she has purple eyes, you know? We'll just go with it. We'll just go with it. Okay. So now let's go ahead and get her outfit. So I might need a reference photo. Hold on. Sorry about that, guys. So far, so good, honestly. Okay, so she has a purple crop top. Honestly, like this. Like a long sleeve crop top that's purple. Or a long sleeve shirt in general that's purple. It looks tucked in at least. At the least it's tucked in, but I don't know if it's like a full crop. Ooh, this is cute. It's not the same purple though. This is a lot lighter of a purple. But it's really cute. <laughs> but it's kind of really super cute. And I kind of want to go with it. Mm, we might go with it. But it's like more blue. It's pretty blue. It's not really even that purple. It's like a lilac-y, bluey purple. Like, I know I have, exactly, I know I have better options, you know? <sighs> How dare. How dare I have so much CC? Can't decide. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I want to download more. <laughs> okay. I don't, have en I don't have enough. That's the problem, actually. I need more options. Um, I kind of want to go with this. I know it's kind of blue. But it's really cute, I'm not gonna lie. Um, okay, so now we need the skirt, which the skirt is a plaid skirt. It's like a dark plaid skirt. Don't know if I have that, honestly. Hold on, yes I do. Oh, maybe I don't. There we go, that one's, that one's pretty close. That one's pretty close. That one actually works. Works really well, okay. We'll go with the one with the purple accents. To tie in a bit more purple to the, the to the fit, you know? Ooh, does this come in purple? No, it doesn't. Here, what if we just colors purple? See what they got. What the sim sees as purple, you know? That's really cute, but it's just not the vibe. Oh, this is really good, but hers is not shoulderless. 
Oh, I... Oh my god, she got bazongas. Holy crap. Oh, that's so cute. I just love all of these. That's, not, that's my problem, is I love all of these. You know what? You know what? Oh, this is so cute. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? Is there another purple one? No. Okay. We're going to go with the shoulderless one. Because I think it fits the best. Like, the color. Specifically, the color, I think, fits the best. And, you know what? I like it. So, we're going to go with it. We're just going to give her a little necklace. Because she has, like, a moon necklace. I don't have... Oh, I do have a moon necklace. Okay. Oh, wait. We're a gold jewelry girl. I forgot. Because IRL, I, I like uh, silver jewelry more. But, yeah, no. Izumi Arasaka's a gold jewelry girl. Cute. Okay. Oh, so cute. She has a belt in the show. She has like a gold belt to match her gold jewelry. Um, but I don't really have like a belt, but I do have these like waist chains if I could find them. Here they are. Oh, they don't show up. Dang it. I was hoping they might go over the skirt, but I think they're too low for that to show up. Okay, she has ripped tights, which... We have ripped tights. Gotta love. I also have like stocking versions, but I think we're going to go with the full tights. And then I think she has boots. Yeah, she has like brown boots with like a gray top. Like the top of the boot is gray, which could be socks. Oh, oh wait, this might be perfect. Ooh, it's a little too wintry though. Like I know we're in, we're in like the fall and winter in the show, but like... I think it's a little too, like, outwardly winter, you know? <gasps> what if she had leg warmers? What if we did, like, gray or brown shoes and then gray leg warmers? Or, like, black and black? Oh, that's so cute. I have to do that now. We're gonna do that. I'm sorry. It just has to happen. Okay, makeup. Normally, I don't do this last, but I forgot to do it earlier because she's just so naturally pretty, and so are you. Oh, my God. Let's do... I feel like she would have a like a nice little nude lip and then she definitely is a highlighter and blush on the nose girly I mean just look at her yeah I know exactly um she would have a little bit of eyeliner I feel like but it wouldn't be too bold it would probably be something like this or it would be something like where is it like this I think this oh <gasps> Ooh, I like it with the slight underline underneath the eye. Oh, cute. Okay, so here we are. This is Izumi Aisaka, or at least my Sims version of Izumi Aisaka in The Sims. Okay, let's do the next character. Let's do Kenji next. Kenji. Kinoshita. I think that's how I spelled her last name. Okay, she, her pronouns, a teen and i would say her main aspiration genuinely is probably to have a happy family which she doesn't have yeah probably um she's a geek uh she's a video game lover where's video game lover hold on hold on i need a coffee break she's a very loyal person genuinely sometimes a little too loyal I'm not gonna lie is video game lover not a thing for teens? I guess not. Okay, in that case, we'll give her, like, the bookworm. I feel like she'd also be into reading. Um, like, reading, like, manga and stuff a lot. Um, light novels. And then let's also give them ambitious. Is ambitious also not a thing for teens? Why do teens not get the fun little, fun little ones? Rude. Fine, she'll be, I don't know, a bro. Woo! Nice. No. <laughs> Not a bro. I wanted to give her perfectionist. That works. Kenji Kinoshita. Okay, let's make her look more like Kenji. Let's strip her down. She got a little bit titty, but not nearly as much as Izumi, probably. She's pretty, like, tall and lean um, in my head. But she's still got them thighs. I mean, she's a woman, you know? 
She got more ass and she got titty and that's okay. She got pretty broad shoulders. And I'd say she's honestly a little bit muscular. I think she would work out in her free time when she's not streaming because she'd want to like be out of the house as much as possible. So let's give her that. Let's give her that body type. Okay, so now to the face. Let's make you look more like Kenji. The jawline's honestly not that far off. I want it to be a little bit more square. Um, let's fix the lips as well. Those are pretty good. I think that's that nose is probably the most accurate to what I have in my head. And then let's do... Mm, the nose is not accurate. Hold on. Once I added the eyes, I was like, nope, doesn't work anymore. That nose is actually probably more accurate. Let's fix the eyebrows as well. EA eyebrows would be a little too wild for me. Oh my god, she's so pretty. Oh, oh my god, she's so pretty. Oh my god, hi. Hi, hey, girly. You're so pretty. Oh, you're so pretty. Oh my god. She's pretty pale. She's pretty pale. Oh, wow. She's gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's give her makeup. Not that you need it, princess. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. She would probably have pretty light makeup. Kenji doesn't seem like she'd wear a lot of makeup, but she'd wear a little bit. She'd be more of a, like, a uh, natural blush, probably, person. Something kind of like that. And then a little bit of lipstick. Oh, so pretty. Okay, hair. I meant her hair being a little bit wavy, but pretty straight overall. Also, her hair is black. Oh, I gave her pigtails and she looks like Sniper Wolf. I'm scared. <laughs> Please don't tell people where I live. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty on her. Anyways, um, oh my, she's so hot. Oh my god. I'm thirsting over my Sims, guys. Y'all. Okay, I think she'd have a necklace or something that oh maybe a layered look um no i actually don't think she'd wear a lot of jewelry i think she'd have her ears pierced but she wouldn't wear much outside of that okay we need to find her flannel we were not going to be able to find her heart shirt as much i love her heart shirt her heart shirt is so like cute and iconic um i want to make merch of it so that i can buy it and wear it um and pretend like it's kenji's and pretend like she let me borrow it um <laughs> girl of my own characters it's a problem it really is but we'll try to find something in the realm of that a jacket look you know um does this have anything not really that is cute but it's not at all similar really at all <gasps> y'all this is perfect wait oh wait no she has gray plaid and then a red skirt. Th this is perfect then. Oh my gosh. Okay, we just need to find the red skirt. Wait, is it a skirt? Yeah, it's a skirt. Okay. Skirts. That's literally, that's literally it. That's literally, that's literally her skirt. Okay, cool. And then it looks like she has boots, black boots. That's honestly pretty similar to what I had in mind. That, that actually is like perfect. I wish there was a sock that like barely, I guess that's the closest, like barely peeked out of the top. I just want like a little bit. That's, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, oh my God. They're so fucking cute. Okay. Kenji Kinoshita. Oh, so cute. Okay. Let's go ahead and do Mako next. Mako. Matsumoto, I think that's her last name. She, her, teen. Did I make her a teen? Did I make her a teen? She needs to be paler. I'm looking back at it. I think she needs to be a little bit paler. There we go. Oh, but that looks a little... It, hmm. That's good. I like that. Okay. Okay. 
So she's creative. She's a storyteller, bustling author. Yeah, that'd probably be the closest. Um, she's adventurous. She's definitely a geek. Um, a bookworm. And because of her household, I'd probably say proper is something that she is definitely. Okay, let's strip her down and turn her into Mako. Oh, I love Mako. Okay. I'd say this is Mako's body type. She's on the curvier side. She's fucking gorgeous. Um, let's make her face look more like Mako, though. <laughs> let's fix the eyebrows as per usual. I forgot we're gonna have white hair. Okay, maybe I should give her darker eyebrows just to like balance it a little bit, I guess would be the best way to put it. Like maybe like blonde rather than white eyebrows. I don't know, what's gonna look better? Maybe, ooh, maybe these eyebrows. Or like gray, gray, gray eyebrows. Gray eyebrows, and then we got blue eyes. Oh, she's so cute. Cute, look at her oh she's so cute okay 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 let's find let's find some hair that fits mako and her vibe that honestly is really accurate right off the bat let's look at some others let's look at some others just in case we find something that's better nothing's really hitting as well as the first one did this one's cute i like the headband but i don't know the first one is just like really really cute Oh, wait, this one's good because she has a big swoop over. Like, she does this to her hair a lot. She's an emo girl. Uh, <laughs> so let's go ahead and give her face details. Hold on. Oh, those anime girl eyelashes. So freaking cute. Okay. For makeup, she'd have pretty bold eyeliner, I feel like. Oh, the sparkly. The sparkly eyeshadow. That's the move for sure. I'm struggling with which eyeliner. I like this one a lot. We'll just go with that one. We'll just go with that one. And then some blush. She'd have some pink blush. Um, and then I feel like she'd have some really cute lip gloss. That's pretty. That's really pretty. Oh, she's so pretty. Okay. Do we want to keep her eyebrows gray or do we want to switch them to white? I think the gray a little bit darker than her hair just to help them stand out a little bit more i feel like she'd probably color in her eyebrows to be darker um if they're not naturally like that as well I'll go with these eyebrows oh she's so pretty oh my god she's so pretty okay so for her, her outfit she has a pink like cardigan or like sweater over a white crop top and gray skirt it looks like Oh, yeah. And she has a pink choker. So let's add that as well. Okay. I wonder if I have a choker, but we could add like this. That's cute. I like that a lot. Yeah, we'll do that. And let's also give her some earrings. I feel like she'd just wear little, little earrings. I don't think she'd wear something too, too standing out. Like maybe like these. Hmm. Actually, no earrings. I genuinely, I don't know if she'd wear earrings or not. Okay, so let's start with, let's find, let's, honestly, the one we used, this one, might be what we're looking for. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's pretty accurate to what she has. But I kind of want, no, 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 we'll do, we'll do what's accurate. This skirt's perfect, but it glitches the top. We might actually have to go with a different top. Hold on. Because the skirt's, like, perfect. We could go like this. Oh, wait. This is actually really nice. Because, like, it's basically a short sleeve version of the exact same thing she has going on. Because it's kind of like an off-the-shoulder type of vibe. I'm trying to see if there's a way I can add an undershirt. That's the closest. And that's just not... It's not doing it for me. I just think she'd get dress coded. And so I kind of don't know if that's going to be a good idea. Hmm, this skirt seems to glitch out multiple things. So we might just have to change the skirt. Mm, yeah, we might just have to give up the skirt. Which, not a fan because the skirt is really accurate, but it's okay. We'll try to find another skirt that fits. I mean, that one's not bad. 
but it's not plaid, which is one of the defining features of the skirt. That's kind of cute. You might be able to do that. This is just so accurate. It's just so accurate that I really want to go with it. I could just do a non-plaid gray skirt, I guess. Like, that's really cute. And so is that. Ooh, what if we did, what if we did a jean skirt instead? Switch it up a little bit. Because, like, all of them have plaid skirts right now. Oh, that's really cute. I like that. Okay, yeah, we'll go with that. And then what are her... So she has cute little socks. She has a band-aid on her knee. And then she has pink sneakers okay so for sneakers i love these sneakers these are like my go-to when my sims wear sneakers i just think they're so cute um and then she has cute little honestly i might give her i might give her leg warmers because her character fits leg warmers really well or like or like knee highs i'm not sure though Okay, I know this isn't the most accurate to the show, and I was really trying to keep it as accurate as possible, but I just think she looks so cute in this outfit. We're going to add a little bit more detail. I'm going to see if I can add any accessories to the top to make it a little less, I guess, bland up top, but I really, really like this outfit so far. That's really cute. I think I might do this, honestly here let's let's get rid of the necklace if we were to do this if we added white leggings white tights i think that's really cute i think it's really her too i think she would definitely wear something like this we're gonna go with it we're gonna go with it she's so freaking cute okay so so far we have Yuzumi Asaka, Kenji Kinoshida, and Meiko Matsumoto. Okay, so let's go ahead over to Denki now. Our first boy today. Our first boy toy. Teen. Denki. What's Denki's last name? Hold on. <laughs> Shimada? I think it's Shimada. Shimada, I was right. Okay. Shimada, I hope I have a hair for him. Because he has such a specific hairstyle and I love it so much that I really want to do it justice. He's a big boy. Give him a big boy. Big boy body. It's cuffing season and all the girls I need and they want a big boy. I don't know the lyrics, but hey. He's a big boy, okay? Let's replace his brows. He's got light brown eyes. Oh my god, he's so cute. Okay, hold on. Oh, he's so adorable. Hold on. I, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Um, I don't know if I want to do eyelashes for him. I don't really do eyelash. I don't make male sims very frequently. And I don't really, I don't think I normally do eyelashes. Um, especially mask sims specifically. Okay. I feel like he would have some freckles. Like that. Like that. The nose ain't nosing. Hold on. Let's look at some different noses. Big nose. It's not big enough. I really like big noses, okay? I think big noses are really hot, so... Okay, listen. Okay. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Okay. So now for hair. I'm crossing my fingers. I can find something somewhat similar to his hair. This is the most similar, but it's longer than this. And it's a lot of the time he keeps it in like a little ponytail in the back. Like that. But I can't really find anything that's the length it needs to be. So this might be our best bet. Unless we go CC shopping, which I kind of want to go CC shopping for this. But it's going to be so hard to find the exact hair I have in mind. There needs to be more hair like this, okay? We'll go, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. I thought I downloaded hair that fit. Hold on. Let's get rid of the masculine category because maybe it just got put in the wrong category. This is the closest, but it's a little too long. And also, it's not in the hairstyle I want it to be. Oh, he's got such a little baby face. 
It's like this, but it's a low pony. This honestly might be the best option we have. I might go with this. I think we should go with this. We'll go with this. <laughs> Your little <Uh-oh>. booty. <laughs> okay, so he has like literally this sweater. <laughs> literally the first one I find. Um, Let's look around just to see if there's anything more similar, but like that's literally his sweater. Like that's literally the sweater he has on. We'll go with this because I think tucking it would look really cute. Oh, he's so cute. Oh. And then I think he just has jeans. He wouldn't wear those types of jeans. Hold on. This is probably types of jeans he would wear. Like that. And then I actually don't know what type of... Oh, no. He has more gray jeans and then he wears white... Uh, white sneakers. So let's do white sneakers as well. Yes. There he is. Oh, we forgot to do his aspirations and traits. Hold on. I would say, okay, so Denki is very creative. I'd say he's more, he's, he's more like going for a soulmate though. Um, he's loyal. He's a little competitive, not gonna lie. He's a geek. And I'd probably also say he's... He's good. He's just like a good guy overall. Oh, he's so cute. Look at him. Oh, I love him so much. Okay. Next up, Zenshin, I think. Yeah, let's do Zenshin. Okay. Zenshin. Matsui. Yes, I think that's how you pronounce this. That's, I think that's how you spell it. Okay, teen. Um, and then... For aspiration, we'll do a serial romantic for now. Um, but it's changing, I feel like. I feel like it's not as much now as it used to be. Mm. He's proper because of how he was raised. Well, He's a snob because of how he was raised. He's jealous because of how he was raised. Um, but he also, he's also a, he's also a geek, <laughs> deep down. He really is. He's also sweet, deep down, but you know. It's really deep down. <laughs> so he's pretty like scrawny, oh, I'd probably say. Not scrawny. That's not a nice word to use. Um, <laughs> it's because it's Zenshin. <laughs> he's pretty thin, but I'd say he has a little bit of muscle on him. Mm-hmm. Just a little bit. Like that. Yeah. Okay. And then for his face, he's very pale once again, because all my characters are pale apparently. Um, And then... He has purple eyes. Let's replace the eyebrows. He has black hair. I'm so bad at picking what lips to use for guys. I don't know why. Mask Sims, I am not the best at. I think that's fine. I don't know. Okay, so he has like swoopy hair. This is <laughs> already it. Okay. <laughs> this is already what he has. Let me look a little bit just to make sure. I feel like he'd have dimples. Can I give him dimples? Yeah. I might give him glasses because he had glasses when he was younger. And I think that they're really cute. And so I kind of want to give him glasses, even though he doesn't have glasses modern day him. But who knows? Maybe he'll have them again one day. This is also pretty accurate. We might do that one instead. So our options are this one and, and... this, this is, I think, more Zenshin. We'll do that one. Yeah, we're going to add his glasses. Because he's cute with his glasses. Look how cute he is. So much cuter. I mean, he's cute regardless. Because he's just a objectively cute Sim. Or character, I guess. Not Sim. Um, but I don't want him to... I don't want to find him cute. He has a gray sweater, ripped jeans. Okay. Gray sweater. Sweater. And it's kind of like rolled up a little bit. Like his like sleeves are slightly rolled up. Oh, this looks really well because there's like something on his sweater, but it's not like distinct. So like having just like a brand name would make a lot of sense for him. And he has ripped jeans, specifically rips in them. Mm -hmm. Um. this is probably good. And it's like, they're kind of like this, I'd probably say. And then he has 
gray shoes with white socks. That's cute. Okay. Yeah. Oh, his necklace isn't showing though with the sweater. Hold on. We'll pick another one. It has his necklace showing. Cause like his necklace is pretty iconic. I'm not going to lie. We could do this. I like that. I like that a lot. Senshin Matsui, ladies and gents. If you like this, let me know down in the comments down below who is your favorite recreation. We got Izumi Aisaka, we got Kenji Kinoshita, we got Meiko Matsumoto, we got Denki Shimada, and we got Zenshin Matsui. If you guys want me to create more characters, like if you want me to create uh, Brianna and Lee, um, possibly maybe Principal Matsui or Rin or Hiroshi, please let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to do a part two to this, but I've already been recording for an hour, so I feel like I probably should wrap up. They're really cute. I kind of want to play around with them. I might do that for fun later. Who knows? Anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe!